I said, we'll, we'll closely monitor you, the lady who rang me Saturday night. She said, oh, all right. Never had anyone come reluctantly to our health retreat before. I found out why later. Her mother and her sister had paid for her and were pushing her to go. So she came. Early that morning, I was praying. I said, Father in heaven, what do I do with this lady? She's about to go on dialysis. And then God put into my mind a few things. Remember that early morning. My celery was going to seed. Did you know that celery is an excellent kidney herb? My parsley was going to seed. Did you know that parsley is an excellent kidney herb? Cooch grass is all through my yard and trying to get into my garden. I'm always pulling it out. Another kidney herb. So I gathered all of this and what I did was I made her up a litre or a quart of tea every day with the celery seed. The, I just put the tops in and I put some ginger in there to make it taste a little bit better so it didn't taste like grass. <laughs> As I'm consulting with this lady, I discovered that she only drinks two, maybe three glasses of water a day. She would say, look at my legs. There's, there's too much water in my body now. Can you see that reasoning? It's because she's dehydrated that the body is actually unable to handle that water. So what happens in this reabsorption here is not only pH is balanced, but so is sodium and water levels in the body. So when that goes down, can you see why the legs swell? Her blood pressure was high. Blood pressure is also monitored here. She was having three cups of coffee a day. She's a nurse and nurses drink a lot of coffee as a rule. <laughs> coffee dehydrates you even more. I discovered she had a gluten intolerance. And because she was a nurse eating a lot of fast food, was lot, lots of cookies and sandwiches on the run. She also had a hormonal imbalance. She said to me, I will not be able to walk with the guests in the morning. I said, that's right, <laughs> not with those legs. But what I'd like you to do is I'd like to get on the little rebounder for one minute every hour, just doing this, just this. That's called the health bounce. <laughs> Anyone can do that. And that will stimulate the lymphatic system to start dispersing the fluid in the legs. I said, I want you to drink a litre of water a day and a litre of this tea. And that was far more than she was usually drinking. But I said, you are never to drink a whole glass at once. You have to drink it little by little, by little, by little. And the kidneys can cope a lot better with that. So Monday morning, she did not walk with the guests. Tuesday morning, she walked with the guests. Her legs had gone down by half. She was so excited. She hadn't seen them like that for weeks. She was a very happy lady when she went home. We wrote a program for her to continue. She emailed me three months later. She said, I don't have to go on dialysis. Isn't that incredible?